Suzanne, out there in Vils now is super involved in Spain with Chilida, with your opening soon of the gallery. Why? And could you tell us what you are going to do here? Um, well, why? We would ask um, Ivan and Manuela. I think it's um, it started out of love because they um, always visited Mallorca and then they discovered Menorca, so that's how the Menorca project started, out of love for the island and the possibilities that, you know, could be offered to our artists. But in terms um, of the art market? Oh, in terms of the art market, sorry. Um, well, you know, we now represent Eduardo Chiida, uh, which is a, a very important estate to the gallery, and he was a very important artist in the 20th century, so it's good for us, it's, it's um, it's a it's a very strong market. We do not only Eduardo Chida, but also all of our artists. We uh, have placed um, many of our artists in collections, in museum collections, private collections. So we have a lot of activity. But is there a big market in, uh, for uh, contemporary art in Spain? Well, I think it's growing every year. Um, there's also a, a large presence of the Latin American collectors in Spain. Okay. Um, Larger. Yes, it's growing and growing. It's very exciting to um, see all these friends coming to Spain and, and um, you know, uh, buying apartments or having establishing a second home in, in, in Madrid, for example, or elsewhere. And so what are you exactly going to do in Menorca? Uh, Menorca will be um, a gallery. We will do exhibitions. Uh, but most importantly, there will be also a very strong education program around it. Uh, we will do, um, you know, we will have activities and we hope it will be a destination for the people in the island and also from Europe and, and all over. But so, but how to make money with so much spending? <laughs> well, we'll leave that to our, um, you know, to, to our uh, financial department, but everything is going well. Yep. <laughs> Muchas gracias. Do you have enough material? <laughs>